Hello, everybody, and welcome back to House Flipper. See what kind of jobs we can do today. I do think today I will also be purchasing a house. Yeah, I already looked at one mission that sounded like it uh, might be fun to do. Actually, I believe two. They're going to do this one and this one. Let's go ahead and read what this one's about. The Inhabitable Bunker. Last week, my dear, sweet wife decided that her mom will live with us. That does not sound good. So I determined that a perfect place for our lovely mother would be a cold metal construction deep underground. To cut a long story short, I want to place her in the bunker. It's all for the sake of safety, of course. For mom to move in, minimal facilities are needed there. A bed, bathroom, and kitchen. And when I write minimal, I really mean minimal. Don't overdo it with comfort. Because, as I think, Mom won't honor us with her presence for long. It would be nice if you added some apocalypse survival items in there, because it would make it easier to convince my wife that it's all for safety reasons. Sign, the one waiting for his lovely mom to move in, son-in-law. <laughs> yeah, that one sounds like it'll be fun to do. So let's get on it. Uh, <laughs> look at that. I don't need to take a bath. <laughs> all right. Nice looking place, actually. Nice, freshly mowed yard. Beautiful home. Uh. Oh no. I recognize that sound. Is that cockroaches somewhere? Where's the stove on? Huh, I feel like I hear cockroaches. Okay, let's see if we can't find where this bunker is. I know I hear cockroaches. Okay. Oh. There it is. Okay. Start here first. All right. Now let's see what's behind here. I hear the cockroaches now. Okay, so I was standing up. Oh, there they are. Ah. Okay, let's get this stuff cleaned up real quick so I can find them easier. Or clean it up easier, I should say. Uh. Oh, I got. Do I got to pick up all that stuff? There we go. All right. Let's get rid of these cockroaches. Not alive. Okay, I assume I gotta get rid of all this stuff so I can see it better, probably. Eighty-four uh, percent done. Not sure where the rest of it is. There's a box right there. Uh, <laughs> could I I could have used that to snipe the cockroaches. All right. Uh, where's the rest of the trash? Hmm. I'll have to find it. All right, guys, got the dirt cleaned up, picked up all the trash, put the stuff back on the shelves, except for that can. I forgot about that. You guys did not see that. <laughs> I need to buy some stuff for this room. 
What a turbine power generator. A thousand bucks. Holy cow. Holy cow, I think it's massive. Uh, let's go ahead and put her right here. If I kitchen up with sink. Let's go with that one. Uh, let's stick it. Let's go right over here. Cabinet with double doors. There we go. Keep it matching. Put it on. Right there. Cabinet with hanging shell. Stick that. Let's put it on this other side right here. There we go. Need a bunk bed for his mother to sleep in. <laughs> Holy cow. Uh, let's stick it right there. There's a drain right there. If you need to go to the bathroom and you're too lazy to get up, you can just sit. <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> Induction hook top. Oh, I could probably put that on top of the counter, can't I? Yep. Need simple table. Oh, this place is getting kind of cramped. Put it right there and two chairs. One, and two. All right. What are we doing here? Clean dirt. Put a toilet. Shower. Okay. Kind of like. Right, uh, I think is this the mounting device for the toilet. It looks like it to me. I'd say, or is this it? So I think this is it. We'll find out here in a sec. Let's go with the metal toilet. I say that would fit the uh, theme of the the bunker theme. Uh, okay, I think I've got the wrong thing unscrewed. I should have just unscrewed it all. Oh, of course it says you can put a toilet right there. <laughs> all right, metal toilet. All right, now. Oh my word, this guy must really hate his mother-in-law if he's doing this to her. <laughs> go yeah, let's go ahead and get I'm um, think that must be for the sink then uh let's see if we can find there we go I like this sink change that I'll just keep it like that mount it right there I think I've said this before but I wish this stuff was as easy in real life as it is on here that now let's go ahead and unscrew the stuff with the shower and get that mounted um go with this one i guess it's the cheapest and i'm sure as much as this guy hates his mother a lot, I'm sure he doesn't care if the items are cheap and crappy. <laughs> Go 
what am I missing here? Clicking it. There we go. Click the corner. Just finished. I assume there's something through this door I gotta do as well. Move trash and clean dirt, and then I think we'll be done. Does that count as trash? No. Alright. All tasks completed. 12,000 bucks. So that's a pretty good profit. All right, guys, back here at the shop. Go ahead and believe it's this job that sounded interesting. Hi there, after the death of my beloved wife, I sold our old house as it brings back so many memories that I cannot cope with. I decided to buy a new house that requires some work. It needs cleaning and new radiators. It is too much work for me. And I don't have the strength. I would like to move out of my old house as soon as possible as it's too painful to live here. My two daughters will be living with me and would like their rooms to be painted their favorite color, bright blue. Please try to arrange everything quickly. Jack Robbins. Let's go ahead and help this guy out. Alright guys. Another beautiful home. Man, there's a lot of beautiful homes on here. Oh, I already got some trash. Boom, that job is done. That was easy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay, so maybe this job won't be as difficult as I was thinking. Or as interesting, I guess I should say. Like it says renovating house, so I had to naturally I assumed I was gonna be like, you know, busting down doors and uh, walls and stuff like that. So I don't know, it's not looking like that's how this is gonna go. But hey, easy money. Beautiful. Jump across here and hit this room. Okay, clean this up. Man, if only it was this easy to clean up stuff in real life. Clean dirt, clean window, paint, and mount the vices. Alright guys, got this room done, got it painted, got the furniture in, and the radiator up. Pretty nice. Let's go on and see what we got to do in the rest of the house. Remove trash and clean dirt. There's that. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Uh, let's go in this room. Clean dirt, mount. A towel radiator. Go. That radiator up. Easy job, easy money.
There you go. Bathroom's done. Uh, what's this way? Let's hit this room. Clean dirt, clean window, remove trash, and mount a towel radiator. Uh, where's the dirt at? It's 34% of it. There we go. I think cleaning the windows is fine, though. I don't know why. I just like it. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, these jobs are like they're not as interesting as the ones where you get like destroy walls and stuff like that. They're kind of relaxing and it's easy money, you know. I did one the other day when I was playing without filming. I had to clean this guy's whole house. He had like this big like mansion out in the middle of nowhere. I had to clean it and take down Christmas decorations and put up new Christmas decorations. It was a handful. Um, let's go this way. The dirt now. Yeah, that, that one was a handful. That was a fun job, but it did pay pretty good, though. I will give it that. house looks a lot the setup of it looks a lot like that one I did with the cockroaches in it it's window clean there we go and radiator this is a large room so I'll go with the large radiator I believe it mounts the same way. It's just like a mega sized radiator. Perfect. Let's take care of this one. What do we got to do? Remove trash, clean dirt, clean window, and mount a radiator. Okay. Okay, well, I really like I've, what I've done to my broom. I've upgraded it and stuff like that. I can reach stuff far away with it and it cleans pretty fast. These windows clean. There's that one. There's that. Uh, where's the radiator go? Oh. Oh, it goes behind here. I need to move this. Oh, that's a good place for the couch. That will block the heat, and that could be a fire hazard if you ask me. But, not my home. <laughs> not my farm, not my pig. <laughs> I'll, I'll, when I tell the guy the job's done, I'll tell him that he should probably move that couch, because... That seems to me to be a fire hazard. That will block the heat from the room. That will just... Your radiator won't do you any good. <laughs> Alright. Is this the last room? I want to say it is. Remove all this trash. Clean dirt. Clean window. Paint. And mount devices. Ooh, I gotta buy some stuff as well.
All right, guys. Got this job completed in here. Now I need to figure out what am I missing? Something. Oh, there it is. Okay, what do we got to do? Remove trash, clean dirt, clean window, paint, mount devices, radiator, and do some other stuff. I think there's another bedroom. Trash. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the color in here, so yeah, I'm kind of glad I'm painting it. Go. These windows now. And this house must have been sitting empty, or the previous owners never cleaned it. Because how on earth do you let your windows get this dirty? go paint with the colors gray and royal blue if they all paint the same way it's painted right now I think I'll go with the blue right here where the purple is and the gray over here All right, guys, got it painted. Uh, I kind of think I should have went the other way around. I think it would have looked better if I painted this blue and this gray, but eh, too late for that now. <laughs> Let's go ahead and mount the radiator. So personally, I don't know if I'm really a big fan of doing like accent walls and stuff like that, you know? Or things where one room is painted one color and the other side is another color. I kind of prefer it to just be, you know, one way. Okay, so I'm assuming this is the father's bed. The other best, I kind of give him a, you know, like a more kind of girly look, if you would. I figure those are the girls' beds. This bed, though, let's try and find. Let's go with. Let's go with that. I like that. Let's mount it. Do it like this. The wardrobe. Let's put that right here if I can. Yep. Double chest of drawers. Stick that right there. Bookcase. There we go. All tasks completed. Made $11,360.13. Pretty nice. All right, guys. Back here at the office. Let's go ahead do some quick house shopping before I end the video. It's in at $84,013.27. Uh, so we... There's a good bit of houses I can get. Hmm. I don't want to go too crazy because I'd like to have some money left over. What's this? A house with a garage for major renovations. The price includes the furniture and the car of the previous owner. Probably make some money selling that car. Beautiful property. Okay. Uh, what about this one? Home admin legend? This is the home of a true legend. Fully equipped when buying this house, you need to follow the regulations on the website. I don't know what that means. fan of the layout of that home. At least from the pictures I see. Alleyway of light. What's that? This tiny complex of two buildings and an alleyway in between used to belong to a 
renewed lantern maker who kept the tradition of handcraft in the cybernetic neon lit world. It's like some kind of DLC thing. I don't really like that. Uh, Mini Generations House. Great opportunities. 30 hours in the 1930s on a large plot of land in a great location for major renovation. Um. Thinking either that one or the home and car. Probably make more money. Let's see. That has seven rooms in it. This one, five rooms. I think I'll go ahead and buy this one. I don't want to spend so much money. This will help get a bit of money left over. I can get started on renovating it pretty soon. Yeah, let's go ahead and buy the first house. You buy a new house. You want to go there right now? Yeah, let's go ahead and go there and see what that thing looks like. Buyers, on the left you can see the thumbnails of buyers, tiny and tiny, they will comment on your actions. Pay attention, especially to those on top. The higher they are, the more they are willing to pay for the house. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Let's walk around the outside first. Already tell it's not looking too hot from the outside. Look at that. Nice little back porch area. Put a grill and such back there. Looks like the yardies mode. I don't know if if you have to have the garden DLC to get the yard mode or if that's just something that happens. I don't know. Alright. Let's go inside and see what the scene looks like. I'm debating too if I want to change the exterior any. We'll find out as it goes along. Oh my word. Oh, okay. I, I think first order of business when I start working on here is I'm going to just completely gut this thing. Oh my stars. I don't think there's anything in this house I'm going to want to keep. Oh, this bathroom is terrible. It's rancid. Oh, holy cow. Ugh, that's ugly. Yeah. I think just about everything in this house is going to go. Maybe this fridge can stay. It looks alright. I don't know. This house probably smells funny, honestly. In real life, it would be. This goes to the back porch. Yep. Alright. Oh, that's gonna need fixed. Pictures from a vacation, I assume. Yeah. God, yeah, that's all the rooms I looked at. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Okay, so this thing is going to require a fair amount of work. I think I'll go ahead and clean all the trash up off camera. Sell that stuff off camera, maybe. I don't know. We'll find out. But yeah, thing needs some work. But thank you all so very much for watching. And I believe next week we'll go ahead and get started on this thing. But yeah, thank you again for watching. I can't wait to see you all again very soon. Bye.